What's up guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, in the continuation of my S10, S10 Plus series, uh, today I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you how to transfer data from your iPhone to your new Samsung phone. So as you can see, um, I have a, uh, this a Samsung S10 that I just got recently. So uh, while setting this phone, uh, this new phone, I'm going to show you how you can transfer data completely from your old iPhone to your new Samsung phone. And it's actually very easy using the Smart Switch application. So I'm going to set up my devices and I'll walk you through how you can do that. And the process is actually really easy. Uh, using this connector from Samsung, it's an OTG connector or also known as, you know, a USB to Type-C converter. You can actually transfer all data from your previous phone, previous iPhone to uh, your new Samsung phone. And you also need your iPhone cable. So what you need to do, just actually um, start your phone and actually um, start your iPhone also. Once you have unlocked both of your phones, uh, you actually need to um, run the smart switch application in your Samsung. Uh, it should be under your Samsung folder. Run the, run the application, click on receive data, because this is what we are going to do today. And there are actually two ways of uh, connecting your phone to your previous iPhone, either with the cable or with the wireless. I'm not gonna connect with wireless because actually, it's actually slower than cable. And I also have the cable already ready with me. So let's connect uh, with, the, with the cable, click on the cable and let's connect the devices. The USB port goes into the USB part and then you can connect your cable like that and the other end goes to your iPhone. Once connected, it will detect both of them as connected and the transfer will begin instantly. So I'm gonna pause this video and I'll be restarting the video when it's near completion. And it's almost done. As you can see, it's actually 99.2%. I believe it took me about like six minutes as it, it actually uh, told me. Uh, let's click that transfer button. And what we're gonna do now is actually gonna provide you with all the compatible apps which were in your uh, iPhone, but uh, they were like iOS version of the, of the apps, right? And now it's actually uh, searching for all the Android version of the apps, of the similar apps that are now in your phone. So it's gonna, once you click install, it will be installed in your Samsung device. And now actually you can uh, just keep uh, keep the screen on uh, using this button. And uh, it, it's it's gonna take about like five, about five or six minutes again to actually install all the apps and all the data. So I'm just keep it aside. And now as you can see, uh, the phone is actually uh, displaying this message you, that you can actually disconnect the USB cable because it has already imported all the data and all the apps and you know everything from iPhone to Samsung and it's actually safe to disconnect them now. So I'm going to do that. And uh, we can move the iPhone aside. And just wait for another two minutes for, for the actual installation and updating of all the messages, all the library to be completed. And one advice uh, I actually provide, you know, while doing this step is actually keep your battery charged so that, you know, because you're not sure how, how long it's going to take for the device to transfer data. And, uh, you know, and you don't want to, you know, get your phone turned off during that process. So let's review the summary. So 130 contacts have been uh, transferred, messages have been transferred, and uh, it, it also tells you that uh, you should turn off your iMessage on your iPhone so that, you know, you can receive text messages on this phone. So we can do that. I'm gonna click done and it will be done. As you can see, all the applications have been moved from your iPhone to your new Samsung device. Uh, contacts, if you see contacts, contact details are also there. If you click on the messages, you see messages are also there. And as you can see, the wallpaper is also, you know, it's similar wallpaper that was in the, in the iPhone. So the wallpaper is also moved from your iPhone to your new Samsung phone. Uh, if we click on the gallery, you can see the gallery is also there. You know, all the photos are still there. Uh, that means we have successfully transferred all the data from your iPhone to your new Samsung phone. And in case these apps, as you can see, these are, you know, um, grayed out, these are not compatible. So you can just remove them and also, and, and actually download the new copies of the same, same apps from your Android store. And this is pretty much it from this video. I hope this video was useful for you. And using this video, you can actually transfer all of your content from your old iPhone to your new Samsung phone. And if you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel because there are many more videos coming on the S10 series. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.